is so tough. And this kid, he understands your body weight, distribution, ability to get into a lane. There was some discussion among the officials, and finally we got it straightened out. The foul was not called to Redding. It was on Anderson. Very important. Mm -hmm. That would have been Redding's third. So uh, it took him a while. And they're discussing it again, the officials. Believe it or not, they, they may not be sure. It could be the, the point. And, and an update from the locker room. It was a groin strain for Dixon, and they're evaluating him. Don't know if he's going to be back. Now, we are going to check and see yeah. against whom the foul should be charged. Now, watch Anderson as well. Is a foul from the rear? And I think that's what they got. I think you're right, Anderson. The important thing is they got it right. Yeah, that's exactly. And uh, it was on Anderson. So that sends Reynolds to the line. He's been perfect there tonight, 5-5. Five five. One of those correctable errors they can go to the monitor for. Scotty Reynolds out of Herndon, Virginia. Pretty well documented story. He wanted to sign. His high school coach was a good friend of Kelvin Sampson's. Mm -hmm. So he agreed to... Uh, Signed with Oklahoma, and then his senior year, Sampson elected to take the job at Indiana. Reynolds uh, decided not to go to Oklahoma and was available, and Jay Wright recruited him out of Herndon, Virginia to come, and he has made significant contributions to this Villanova team. He's just so positive, and, and, and he's such confidence. He's undeterred, he taking a hit, so knowledgeable. Young man who talked very freely at the press conference yesterday about the fact that he was adopted. He has found his birth mother in Alabama, but he has not yet contacted her. He said that's in the future. Mm -hmm. Great pressure on the ball now. He's got to loosen it with a screen or a dribble. Fields back to Young. Whoops. Saved it. The wrong way. How about that pickup? Spot up for three. No travel, up and under! He is so intelligent. First thing he did was back up to the three-point line, and then the little pump with the eyebrows that gets their rim and wars off with the pin. This is where Pitt is tough now. They're going to take the crowd out of the... Solid on the approach. Blair's got to duck in and get on cutting it. A little late ball screen. Eight on the shot clock. Here's Fields. In the corner, Wanamaker. Well, pretty good hands again. And it's an anticipation play. A good drive. Smart, but... How about this? He may need a new shirt, but not for not for... UConn gets to its third Final Four, their previous victories in the NCAA Championship. They both come from out of the West. All four number one seeds can make the Final Four. It's happened once before. That was a year ago. And the North Carolina looking pretty impressive. Here's good news, at least in part. Jermaine mm -hmm. Dixon is back on the bench. Do not know if he's going to get back on the floor. And of course, you miss his great defense, his ability to stretch the D with that three-pointer. And you put it on the floor as well. Wanamaker at the line, shooting two. Now, this is uh, not a great fit, free throw shooting two. 67.5. That's good. Average. Mm -hmm. and, and he's pretty good, you know, it's 54 yeah. on his right. They do have nice subs, though. Uh, you mentioned Brown and Wanamaker to come in, replacement of Dixon. And looks like he's getting ready on the sideline. He's adjusting. And he up now. Yes, he is. Here's Fisher ducks in. There's Wanamaker defending. Nice defense. Yes, it was. Blair's got to be careful. And Cunningham gets the basket. Well, that's what he does. Uh, he's improved. Putting it on the floor. They blocked his shot, but confident gets it around. And they, they use Blair on the nice side. How about that look by Brown? But that's 
what he does. He uses that dummy air, clears you out, and then moves it. Right to the 10. Jumper Fisher. Clark with a follow. 